Kane is in the building. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Jack from Tech Tutorials coming at you with the jailbreakme.com jailbreak. Alright, so we have to show you what version we're running. We've got a general to about. Um, can you see? We're at 3.12. Alright, so what you're going to want to do is go into Safari. And the top where the URL is, type in jailbreakme.com 3.0. But since this is your first gen, you have to use the 2.0 jailbreak from jailbreakme.com. Okay, the 2.0 version. Like I said, this has to be the easiest jailbreak out there. Honestly, you don't even have to plug it in the end. Just down there, slide to jailbreak. It doesn't really get that. So it really doesn't get much more easy than that. Alright, so once again, this is all free, legal, and safe. And make sure you guys, before you ever do this, Back up your iPod just in case something bad does happen, which it shouldn't, but there you go. Anyway, so you slide the jailbreak, it's going to say, this might take a while, no, I fast forwarded it, but yeah, so it's going to say, fit tight, uh, I'll see you guys in a little bit, come back and check. Alright, so there you go. The video has been added to your home screen. Now you're going to want to go to your home screen in a second. And it should be there. Okay. And yeah. well, there it is. Oh, video. Successfully, she'll break your iPod. Alright, so there's three things you can be on there the user, the hacker, and the developer. I choose developer because it actually gives you a lot more opportunities to do stuff. And instead of like, a, well, with the user, you get most of the stuff locked out, you just get tweaks and apps and just, you know, the simple stuff. And with the hacker, well, you kind of get the point, hacking. But with developer, it's, you know, it's easier. Alright, well, you know, I just jailbreaked it for you. I would hope it shouldn't be that hard for you guys. Uh, comment in the comment box if you have any problems. You should be responding. Thank you.